Hi, it's Karen and Tim Bates here at the Apple Farm in Philo, California, just north of Boonville. Our move here was um, from the French Laundry in Napa Valley, which was a restaurant that my parents started. My parents found this piece of property and really fell in love with it, and so called us up and asked us if we wanted to be apple farmers. Really, our way of life here at the apple farm is totally dependent on what we can produce here on the farm. We have now about 80 varieties of apples we're growing here on about 2,000 trees and 14 varieties of pears. We've also mixed in some other fruit, quince and plums and persimmons in a rather small way, enough to just sell up front at our fruit stand. Gradually over the years, as we started developing more products, we found that people were coming by and getting them after hours and leaving the money. So we kind of have made it official over the years and we put a change box out there and, and people help themselves and it's all on the honor system. It's kind of funny, it's become one of our claims to fame. <laughs> we chose rammed earth for our house because we felt that it was a, a real connection with the earth and, and some, that's something that's really important to us. I mean, my vision was somehow always that I was gonna be on the land somewhere didn't know quite what the details were going to be, but um, when I heard about the rammed earth, it really just seemed like the right thing to do, to take the ground beneath you and turn it into a shelter. And we also wanted a house that the light would penetrate all the way through, and that's why it's so long and narrow. It, it feels wonderful to, to have the sun come in and wake you up in the morning. We have collected things in our house from everywhere, you know, started with family and um, garage sales, flea markets, um, building some of our own furniture, and then gradually as we could afford it, we started doing a little more shopping. <laughs> I still go to thrift stores and buy books and albums. <laughs> so you can see there's 3,000 albums and nearly 3,000 books. I like the little bit of freshness that Pottery Barn brings to the mix. You know, I don't, I'm not interested in having a house that's all antiques. I like to see, you know, some, a little bit of old, a little bit of new. I like the burst of color. We try to keep, you know, everything we do in our lives you know, on a scale that makes sense within the context of the farm. So I think we have a great future. It's very exciting. But, uh, I'm not planning on leaving, so... Uh, you know. <laughs> I guess I better stay, too. <laughs>